Katy Perry's new collection by OPI consists of four outrageous shades and one of the hottest trends for 2011, Black Shatter. The colors you can see here are the one that got away, a great burgundy shimmer, Last Friday Night, a nice light blue glitter, not like the movies, a great gunmetal that has undertones of green and purple depending on the light, and Teenage Dream, which is an amazing light pink that you can also see here on my nails. You can apply black shatter on any of these shades or any lacquer that's not in the collection as well. So we're going to show you how to apply black shatter. You want to first make sure that your base coat of the lacquer that you've applied is completely dry. And then know that when you're applying black shatter, you want to apply very little pressure and as little of product as possible to cover the nail. The less product that you apply, the more the nail color will actually shatter on you. So very thin coats. This is actually a little bit thicker, so you'll be able to see kind of how that separates. And I'll go ahead and continue with the rest of the nails. And you'll want to keep the lid on your bottle as much as possible because black shatter will actually start to dry out a little bit in the bottle. If you like bigger chunks and a little less color from the bottom shade showing through, then you can apply it thicker with a little bit more pressure. But for a more shattered effect that does show little squares and a lot of the lacquer underneath, then you're going to again want to do it in thin, thin coats. Black Shatter also has a matte finish, so once you're done applying this, you'll want to put on your top coat to not only give it that great sheen, but also to give you long-lasting color. And you can see I'm not really covering the entire nail because it is thin, but once it shatters, you'll see the desired effect. And so once all of the nails are dry, apply your OPI top coat and your nails are ready.